hello 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 everyone you're welcome to in his love channel how are you doing my name is pedita and um you're welcome if this is your first time here on this channel you're welcome and my returning viewers you're welcome also thanks to all everyone that um is supporting this channel one way or the other i really appreciate you guys thanks for all your prayers thanks for your comments thanks for your contribution you know a lot of you say comments a lot of things and uh, even me i'm like wow you know so we are all learning from each other and i appreciate every one of you don't forget to like the video don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't so that we can get uh, videos whenever i upload um don't forget also to uh click your notification uh, button the bell click on it so that way uh, it comes on and you get uh, you get notice whenever i post a video thank you guys so much in advance so continuing on this uh uh what is it jubilee festival scam of pastor ayo richard Falls church word of life bible church and today our case study is um apostle johnson suleiman's uh uh on uh, what he did in the program uh, he basically did the same thing you know he asked them to sow a special seed that he has a leading you know by the spirit <laughs> i don't know which spirit so for them to sow a special offering right and then he, after that he went on and collected ten thousand they should come out and give their offering ten thousand five thousand three thousand you know so offering as offering as high as ten five three thousand and like that till it goes really low you hear it yourself let me not even say everything you hear everything that he said when he was collecting the money but the main part was like they should rush forward and make make sure their hands touch the altar they should rush forward let you say let your hand touch that the altar you know this altar thing <laughs> this altar thing um what altar first of all what altar what altar i'm not even going to say much because the the where they call altar is actually a stage it's just a stage there's no altar there you know anyway he said they should uh make sure that their hands touch the altar so um i'm gonna allow pastor abel uh damina to explain this altar thing for us so that we know that there's no nothing like altar especially in this new testament there's no they, we shouldn't be we shouldn't be talking about altars or dealing with altars anymore you know christ has done all of that for us you know so so you won't be deceived that you're touching one altar or anyway guys so i'll let pastor abel damina do the explaining you know <laughs> do the explanation and the teaching concerning altar so you will not be fooled by preachers like apostle suleiman talking about let your hand touch the altar so watch the video leave your thoughts leave your comments um what you think and uh i'll see you on my next video thanks for watching um like the video share the video and remain in his love god bless you something's going to happen here tomorrow somebody says something will happen here tomorrow i have a leading in my spirit to take I just keep her down there to take an offering and an offering personal offering i've ministered for two days and i said doors open god has restored all just a personal offering that the lord put in your heart that you want to come with tomorrow is between you and the lord please come come and stand here you want to come with that offering tomorrow leave your seat and come forward you want to come with a personal offering tomorrow to plant God is going to tell you some things to do, some very crazy things to do. But you just, you want to, you want to say these words that have come forth. I want, I want to facilitate. Come, come, come. The first three, four hundred of you. Honestly, honestly, listen. I, I am, whatever I'm saying is for your own good. And I'm serious about it. It's for your good. Just come, come. You are going to, going to hold it tomorrow. You are going to hold it tomorrow. What a God we serve. Are you blessed at all? Are you sure? 
So those of you in the gallery who are doing that too, you can join them. Father, I'm asking that this will be phenomenal as they express their love for you and honor you. Do great things for them. Some of you, as you do that in 72 hours, there will be very definite, speedy turnaround. The trajectory of your life will change. In Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. Move to your seat. If you have yours, you can drop it now. If you have yours, you can drop it. Everybody be upstanding. Now hold an offering in your hand. If you have 10,000, you have 5,000, you have 3,000, come to me. Come and cast on the floor. Cast on the altar. If you are in that category, 10, 5, 3, come and cast. Come. If you are watching online, do something. Come, let your hand touch this altar. Everybody in that category, everybody. Let's be upstanding. Can we be upstanding, please? Can we be upstanding? Let your hand touch the altar. If you are upstairs, make sure you do the same thing. Yes, just do that fast. Open your palm, lady. Do that fast. Touch. 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 Let your hand touch the altar. I because you are the temple of God because you house God you don't need an altar all that teaching on altars is fraud fraud daylight robbery the altar is not a place inside the church that's not an altar am I talking to somebody you don't need to go to a place you don't need to there's no place on earth that is special you don't even need to go to israel there's nothing in israel instead of wasting your money to go to israel come to uyo where i live it is better than israel am i talking to somebody here oh i feel like i'm preaching two thousand years ago jesus told the woman by the well you shall neither in jerusalem nor in this mountain worship the time and comet and now is the time when true worshipers shall worship the father in spirit and in truth not in a location <laughs> glory to god and that's why i'm moving all over this place so that you know that that place is not altar <laughs> yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm. what is an altar <laughs> An altar is a place of animal sacrifice. Sure. Are you an animal? <laughs> Why are you going to altar? <laughs> if you are not an animal, why are you going to the altar? Animals are brought to the altar. I'm not an animal. I have an animal. Behold the Lamb of God that taketh away the sins of the world. And my animal has gone to the altar once and for all. I don't need to go to that altar anymore. Why? I am now the altar. If you are looking for an altar, this is the altar of God Almighty. Oh, I feel like I'm raging, God. Sit down, sit down, sit down, listen. The altar, the altar was inside the temple. Yes. Yes. Inside. The altar was inside the temple. The temple were three compartments. Holy of Holies, Holy Place, Outer Court. You, your body, outer court, your soul, holy of holies, your spirit, holy place. You are that temple. Inside you is the altar. So when you walk, the altar is walking. You don't need to go to an altar. You are the altar of God Almighty. I feel like I'm preaching here. If you're understanding, shout, I hear, I hear. Don't let any man of God use your money for breakfast. 
in the name of an altar no 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 man of God has a bigger altar your altar is the biggest altar because your altar is the altar where Christ himself resides in